Hi, this is Ethan Purston from the Sunshine State of Florida, and today I have the double pleasure to interview Kevin James and Taylor Lautner from the Netflix movie Home Team. Kevin James is an American actor, screenwriter, producer, and comedian who is best known as Doug on the show The King of Queens or Paul Blart on Mall Cop, besides other films. Taylor Lautner is an American actor and model who is best known as Jacob Black in the movie series Twilight. We also remember him as Shark Boy on The Adventures of Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Um, hi, I'm Ethan Person with Kids First. What's up, man? What's up? Ethan. Um, so, hi, Mr. James and Taylor. It is an honor to have you here today. Thank it's you. It's an honor to be here with you. So, my first question is for Mr. James. You produced this movie and with actor and comedian Adam Sandler. So, how did you also get to portray Coach Sean Payton? And what ways do you identify with Coach Payton? That's a good question. Um, well, I got the job because of Adam Sandler, because he, he, he was the one who had the, uh, the idea came to him uh, through his brother-in-law. Uh, and uh, I was so excited to, to do it. He was asking me if I wanted to kind of be in, in a movie uh, about Sean Payton. And this was the story. And the story was, you know, about how he went back and coached his son's football team in the midst of, uh, a crazy time in the NFL after he had won a Super Bowl and he reconnected, ended up re reconnecting with his son. And I was like, yeah, I want to, I want to, uh, it sounds like a great sports movie and could be a lot of fun. So, uh, so uh, we signed on and I was like, is Sean okay with this? Does he want to do this movie and all this stuff? And he was like, yeah, he's already in, don't worry about it. And then I was like, yeah, this is great. So uh, <laughs> everything was all set up and I was all uh, excited to be part of it. And that's how it happened for me. And this next question is for Taylor. So you portray Coach Troy, um, and is he based on a real-life coach? And if so, can you identify yourself with this character? Yeah, he actually he is based off a real-life coach. Um, that was Connor's uh, Pee Wee football coach. Um, so it's pretty cool playing playing him. Um, and and I absolutely can because um, it's kind of. Uh, it's cool for me because I started acting at an early age and my, my first feature film I did shark boy and lava girl, I was 12 years old. And, um, and that's the age of all, all of these kids in our movie and uh, my, my football players. So it was, it was pretty cool to see them and how impressive they are and um, to be able to hang out with them on set and, and offer them anything I could. And Mr. James did Coach Payton really go through all those troubles in the hotel, like the hotel that he stayed at in Texas. That I don't know. I don't know if he he went through all that. We, we might have uh, embellished a little bit there and made it like that. But I know he had the he he came into town and it was uh, you know it, for him it was not staying where he was normally staying and he kind of had to uproot his life a little bit. But that was uh, it was a fun part to be able to be in there and, and mess around with that guy, the clerk at the uh, at the hotel, who who actually is Adam Sandler's nephew, by the way. Oh, that's he, so cool. I know there's a lot of relatives from you guys in this film. Yeah, it's a family <laughs> project. And Taylor, this film has such a terrific cast. So what was it working with cast members like Kevin James, Jackie Sandler, Gary Valentine, Rob Shiner and young actors who portray the Warrior football team? It was so cool. It was super exciting for me. It was, it was awesome to work with Kevin. We briefly worked in uh, Grown Ups 2, um, but it was awesome uh, to be his co-star in this. And then, I mean, everybody else, Jackie's so talented and Rob Schneider's one of the funniest dudes on the planet. So to be included, you know, in, in a cast uh, with those type of people was just an honor for me. So much fun. Yeah, and... Mr. James, so as soon as I saw Rob Scheidner as part of the cast, I immediately thought of his famous line, you can do it. So how come he didn't say it in this film? Because I thought it would be very fitting. It would be, I guess. Uh, the only, I guess it was just because it, it was, we wanted to keep it part of the Sean Payton story. So it'd make it special and I, it, 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 you know, in its own way and give it its own thing. But it would have been funny for him to say that, of course. And I think he did say it actually, and it just didn't make it into the uh, end of the film. He did, he did do it, I think, correct? I, you know, <laughs> he you know, did it once. <laughs> yeah, I think he did. 
So Taylor, one of my favorite teas uh, is when the Warriors team gets sick with the vegan super logs before they mm. eat, like how they ate it before the game. So you mm. ate one. So can you share how they created the vomit effect? Oh, man. I think what, from what they told me, it was mainly corn chowder. Um, so they would they'd give us a cup of corn chowder and we'd put it in our mouth before and just on cue, just spit it up. Um, a couple of the kids, I didn't have this, but there was actually these machines that were built into the helmets with like a tube on the side. So if you were looking at them like this, the tube would be over here and that would launch the corn chowder out of the tube. I didn't get one of those, which was unfortunate, but I did get to spit up some, some delicious corn chowder. Well, thank Ethan, you so much. Ethan, Ethan, just a, a little side note too. I was actually caught at the end of the shooting day after everybody wrapped up collecting the corn chowder on the ground with a cup of my own just to bring it home to, back to my hotel room. But <laughs> that's just for you only. I don't want to tell it to any other news out there. Okay? Well, thank you so much for taking the time to speak with me today about this heartwarming film. Oh, and you got it. Congratulations leave, I, on your 49ers, by selfie? the way. Oh, thank you. Yeah. It's my best favorite team. Go ahead, bud. Can I get a quick selfie? Yes. yes. <laughs> All right, thank you. Nice, buddy. Go Niners. Good luck. Good thank to see you. you. Bye. Home Team releases on Netflix on January 28, 2022. I'm Ethan Person reporting for Kids First. Remember to like and subscribe to our channel so you can see more interviews like this one. That's all for today. This is Ethan Person signing off. Goodbye.